Hey, welcome, brothers and sisters, to my channel, Faisal Azid. I hope that you are well. In the previous video, I have shown you some method for processing the stream. So I have seen collect, count, and sorted. Okay? In this video, I will uh, talk about two other methods. Uh, two or uh, three, or oh, three, I think, three other methods. So, we will see now the method mean and max. What is this method mean and max for processing the stream? Mean method retrieve the mean value of object in your final stream, but you might must use our custom comparator. Okay? Not by default. And the same thing for max. Max return the maximum value in the stream, of course, by using also our custom comparator. Okay, so let's see an example with our uh, list of integer, and we we uh, practice with we use the method min and max. Okay, to get the minimum value and the maximum value. So that is number is our list. I will put uh, zero, three, uh, five. By default, huh? uh, 7, uh, 11, etc. Now, if I want to get the minimum value of this list, what I will do, integer mean equal list1 dot stream, this is a stream, and here what I will do, dot mean, dot mean, yes, dot mean now. And the argument of the min method will give him lambda expression. Of course, but our comparator. So I will use here the default uh, sorting to get the minimum value. E1, comma, E2, simple arrow, E1 dot compare E2. Okay? After this, I just have min, but it is not like count method. Here I must add another method to uh, retrieve the value, so when I finish the mean, add dot get, okay? It is important to retrieve our value. It is not like count, count, count directly, if you remember. Like count, oops, and you retrieve your uh, value. But here you use you add the, 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 the method get to retrieve your minimum value. Normally, I will got uh, what is the the minimum value here? Zero or three? Zero, of course. And the maximum will be eleven normally. So if I I make the same thing with maximum, I want to get maximum value in my stream. Also, I will practice. Uh, I, will, I just practice with lambda expression. It is a criteria. You can't uh, get min min and uh, Max without implementing your other expression, it's very important. Oh, my brother, I mean, uh, complementing your comparator, okay? It's very important. So, here is the same thing integer max equal list one dot stream dot max between parentheses, the same of the expression e1, comma e2, compare to uh, e1 dot compare to to e2 dot get okay and I retrieve my maximum value so I will go to the computer to execute this two uh, method mean and max and I will come back for continue for another method inshallah so let's go so let's get our value mean and max our first one is I think value mean integral mean equal here list one dot stream dot mean mean value mean I'll use my comparator same thing e1 comma e2 oops simple arrow e1 dot compare to e2 okay I close all this is. after this dot get okay 
and now system.adminterren the min value is min okay let's see before to use max normally we got zero good let's do the same thing with the max value so i just copy past this one and this one and then return it by the max value okay it's the same thing but here it is max value max and here max max value and well the rest is the same thing and here max equal max so let's see the result 35 okay it's good very good now i will uh, show you another method that exists in the stream for processing the stream and it is for each for each method you know i think uh, for each existing java yes but it is not setting here it's not setting both stream so another concept of course so what is for each for the stream for each for each sorry is a method that apply some operation in each object of the stream using lambda expression that we give him in argument i repeat for each is a method that apply some operation in each element of the stream in each object of the stream using lambda expression that we give him in argument okay for example i have a list of names list of names what i want to do the operation here i just want to display the name in the console so simple example i just uh, make always simple example to understand the concept it's very important so here i have a list of names well what i will do i just want to display each name in the console using system other printer to do this what i will do here so list one okay dot stream dot for each e in uh, for case for each and in argument there is lambda expression simple lambda expression str simple arrow system on system out of return uh, str okay so simple like this there is nothing uh, after this nothing Okay, so I repeat, for each is for applying some operation, for each, for each element of our uh, stream, using the expression that I give him in the argument. So here I will get all the names in my console. And remember, if we have another expression, sometimes we can uh, change it by method reference. Okay, I have uh, talked about this uh, topic in previous video. Okay, here we can do it. Yes, we can do it. So, how to change this lambda expression by method reference? I don't create another method. I don't, uh, it exists, the method. I will show you how to do this. So, I have the same thing. List uh, one dot stream dot for each. And here, what I put in argument system class system dot out okay double colon what is the method name of the method printer okay so i will execute these two uh, method for each using node expression and using method reference to see the result and i will continue inshallah Let's go to the computer. So now I'll create very quick another uh, list that contains a list of names. I command this to instruction by doing them. List string 
Hop, tac, 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 names. Pour avoir l'histoire, cross new array. List of string here. Oops, string. Ok, and after this, names dot added. I mean, copy past uh, three times, just three times, uh, two times, talk, not like this. So, scene and save. Okay, now I will use for each two, just display this name in the console. I'll do this names dot stream dot for each e in uppercase. Okay, and here I will give him another expression. Check what is the action that I want to do is str, no expression str, simple arrow, just system dot out dot print and then, oops, I did, I don't have the shortcut. <laughs> So system dot out dot print n print n is uh, sorry for about str. Okay, let's see there is it for to make the second thing. Tac, tac, tac. Good. Do you see? Now I will replace this uh, lambda expression by method reference like this so names dot stream dot for each and here I put system class dot out double colon and print ln so simple like this so I will come on this one to see if we got the result same as all now let's go Good. Do you see? 